Welcome back guys to Crypto for Life channel. Today we will talk about DYX. Should you buy this coin or not? Let's jump in. Let's to be honest, the crypto is so volatile and the risky asset and you can analyze all metrics, you can analyze all bakers of uh, some project, you can analyze the technology, the fundamental of coins, you can analyze tokenomics of coin, but we saw the lunar crash, the FTX collapse, the funds uh, going bankruptcy, so everything can happen in crypto and behind every single project can be some scammers, can be some funds who just play with the coin. So we just dive into DYDX and I would like to show you the uh, why do I think so? Uh, this coin can pump so much uh, because I have the few reasons and we have to analyze the psychology of the funds and early investors. So let's double check the basic information. So how people basically analyze their coins. Uh, they go to website, they go to uh, read the white paper, they analyze the tokenomics, they check the coin market cap, total supply, maximum supply, circulation supply and market cap. And that's it. But it doesn't work well every single time because we have to analyze and trying to understand the psychology of this project and the psychology of the earlier investors. Because just to be honest, nobody could predict this lunar crash and nobody could predict the pump of Solana from 20 cents to $250 per coin. And now Solana crash once again. And a lot of similar projects we'll see again in the next bull run. And I think that DuetX just will be the one of the projects which uh, uh, big players pump so much and then can crash 90% one more time on the next bull run, by end of next bull run. We got 1 billion total supply, maximum supply 1 billion and less than 10% now in circulation supply. So it means the more coins will be added in circulation supply, the price can drop much, much lower. But it's not unnecessary. Why it's not necessary? Because everything depends on real investors who got the coins on their hands. Because the people think if some coins will be added in circulation supply, it's necessary so the price can drop low. But no, it's not. Because the funds can hold the coins for some specific uh, price. So market cap now only 105 millions. And for the project like this one, it's so low. And here's the first reason why do I think so that DYDX will pump it so much because the more and more people I think start using DEX instead of centralized exchanges because people want a privacy. People don't want to pass the KYC. People want to hide their money. They don't want to show and pay taxes. And some people scare use the centralized exchanges after the FTX collapse. So let's to be honest. So the story can be similar like with SushiSwap or PancakeSwap or Uniswap. So by that time, this project blasts off insanely. And I think for the next bull run, DYDX will be the main decentralized exchange because they got a derivatives and you can trade with futures on DEX. So it's insanely. A lot of people will use this platform because they got now the application so you can trade on the DAX on your phone. Here we can find out the early investors. It's the big funds like Andres Horvitz, A16Z, Crypto, Paradigm, Brent Armstrong. But let's to be honest, not every single time when you see the big bakers, the big names, it means that the project will blast off insanely. No. Just hold on. So now we can go to Misari.io and double check the allocations of early investors and just calculate the average price which uh, funds bought this coin. And here's why do I think so. Till February, the beginning of February next year, we can see the pump on this coin, just a speculative pump just to bring more FOMO for this coin and uh, sell this coin with higher price to the crowd. So according to this matrix, you can find out uh, in February, we can see the unlock of early investors 
and employees, consultants, and trading our foundations. So according by logic, like I showed you in my previous video, now we got a double bottom, perfect double bottom on the weekly time frame. And according to this pattern, we can see just technical analysis. We can see the pump even to five or even seven dollars. Maybe with some weak scandal, we can see even ten dollar till um, beginning of February. And a lot of people jump into this coin and at the beginning of February, the big investors who just fill their bags with the what eggs on the pre-sale just sell off and the price drop insanely one more time. So how we can find and count the price of uh, early investors. So here we go to initial token distributions and we find out the seed round series A, B, C. And here is total investment. 2 million, 10 million, 10 million, 65 million. So we multiply all this one and split to total investors amount. It's 277 millions, 295 thousands, 27 percent. So when we split it, we can find out the average price of early investors of funds was 30 cents. That's why just by logic, I think the big players will pump in the YDX uh, till the end of January before the unlock, uh, the price to $5, $7, and then just after the unlock period, because a lot of people don't pay attention uh, to allocation, to distribution, to the economics, they just sell it at $7, for example, and then we drop one more time to $2 or even $1.90 uh, at uh, February and March. And then the big players grab all this liquidity one more time and push the price much, much higher. And for the people who bought the WX now and wait uh, $100 or $200 per coin, I can say yes, everything possible. Yes, of course, it's hard to imagine how the WX can reach now $100 because of circulation supply, because of uh, maximum supply, because of market cap. But guys, everything came possible everything impossible so we can we saw the Shiba Inu we saw the Luna we saw the Solana we saw uh, the Matic a lot of coins the pump it insanely and uh, now I think the X will be the next coin which can show the great result for the next bull run and only because of funds will pump it insanely and then just cash out of this project and on the next bull run, this project can drop insanely, like Uniswap, like SushiSwap, like PunkySwap. So the story just repeat. Guys, I hope you like this video about the WDX. So now we know the average price of funds. And now you can follow the steps of smart money. Subscribe channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button. And don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.